Arsenal may just have found themselves another Gabriel Martinelli in the form of his talented compatriot Marquinhos. Following another busy summer of transfer activity in North London, the club's first low-key recruit of another statement window had seemingly slipped beneath the radar. Back in May, the Gunners struck a £3 million deal with Brazilian side Sao Paulo for the highly rated teenager who had been ripping it up with his boyhood club in South America. The initial plan was for Marquinhos to remain at Arsenal this season, playing most of his football with the club's under-23 squad, although a European loan move wasn't being ruled out. Upon signing the attacker, Arsenal made it clear that Marquinhos was a player solely for the future encouraging patience when it comes to his personal development. Yet Marquinhos has already made the perfect statement on his Arsenal debut by proving he is ready to be part of Mikel Arteta's first team from the get-go. He was sublime in Switzerland on Thursday night as he grabbed a debut goal and assist against Zurich to put his name up in lights. The 19-year-old took his goal wonderfully and made a difficult finish look very straightforward. As he stroked the ball home for the opener before assisting Eddie Nick Behind the scenes, Arsenal had to battle hard to sign Marquinhos ahead of Wolves, who believed they had a pre-contract agreement in place with the former Brazil U-17 international. Wolves were left hard done by those Arsenal pushed the deal over the line and now they are set to reap the rewards of that. In the final stretches of the summer window, Artito and Edu were determined to try and bring in another dynamic forward to provide some extra firepower. Pedro Neto was identified as the club's top target and there were formal conversations with Jorge Mendes, whose gestifute agency represents the Portuguese winger. Alternative targets including Moussa Diaby, Jeremy Pino and Mihailo Mudrik were also monitored by the Gunners. Eventually, the focus shifted to a central midfielder due to Thomas Partey's recurring thigh problem but ultimately, things have not worked out too badly for Arsenal. Spending £50 million on Neto would have undoubtedly have elevated their forward line to a new level but in Marquinhos, Artita now has a new project to keep him busy. Much like Martinelli and Buke Osaka, Marquinhos is already showing signs of being a top talent one that is capable of hitting the ground running at senior level. It will obviously take time to feed him into the starting eleven, but the Europa League looks like the perfect platform to hand Marquinhos regular minutes. His scintillating display against Zurich suggests he's more than capable of making an impact from the bench in the Premier League when required. Marquinhos is alive, attacking goal threat and he is evidently hungry to make an impact. He has already saved Arsenal a pretty penny.